let's add a lace spine and some trim and then we'll have the flip through it's finished hi everybody it's julie and a short little video we are going to be making um nora's the cover for nora's journal here and i'm, I'm trying to decide it's like if i do the lace cover like i wanted to do it it might not be thick enough huh hmm but look at it it's so darn cute put it you know what i think we'll be okay i'm gonna do it with the lace i think that that's i think that's the style i think she'll like that style okay so i'm gonna go ahead and pull this book over it was a hallmark no american greetings you guys it probably was a dollar back in the day <laughs> A dollar and it's so darn cute isn't it cute do you have any of these books uh, let us know in the um, comments down below do you have any of these books in your stash I have several I had gotten them to use in the Mimi and me journal kits that we ended up doing my mom passed away before we got them um, got to do them, so we called them, I think they were Mimi's birthday or something like that. They were really cool. Um, lots of vintage pieces, and I did finally sell all of them. So, and everybody's been getting their their orders from the huge sale. And so I think my next sale is going to be um, fabric, okay? So I have fabric that was, um, that's mine and was, and then I also have from my mom's stash. So I think I can do this right here, that size. Um, now I have to decide which glue and fabric tack will just come up off of this. So I'm thinking we can use this. Okay, it works on um, playing cards. Of course we could scuff it, you know what, let's do that. Let's scuff it up with some sandpaper. I'm gonna go ahead and grab this glue off here. And find us a piece of sandpaper. It, it always goes back in the back there. Oh, I'm going to grab my book. And I'm going to leave it open. Okay. And I'm just going to scuff, scuff the edge. So that there will be something besides shiny for my glue to attach to. Okay. If you wanted to make this even look a little more um, scruffy, you can go a, a little more. But I'm just taking the shiny off. And that'll give us a place for the journal to attach to. And we'll come and grab the other one. Okay. And I've got, I think these were from um, Dollar Tree, actually. Make sure that my inside piece looks ready to be because um, I'm not going to add anything more to that because I liked I liked these inside pages. Okay. 
fluffy, but it is it is aged. So, whoop. Sandpaper down. Okay. Whew. Very gritty. Gritty, gritty, gritty indeed. Okay. So, this is going to be the cover. Let's get as much of the sandpaper off as we can. This is going to be the back. Okay. We're going to go ahead and put our glue down. And we'll put the, I don't, my sewing machine wouldn't go through this. If my sewing machine would go through this, I'd go ahead and, and sew this. I'm going to go ahead and, since it's lace, Okay, so that's one side. Then come over and add glue to this side as well. It's going to take it a little while to dry. Okay. There we go. I think we'll just use the bottom of this. I hate the feeling of this on my fingers. Okay. And again, I'm going to go over this. I wonder if I should make that a little bit bigger on this side. Okay. So there's, go back where there's little holes. I don't know if that'll help or not, but I'm going to try it. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and let this dry. Then we'll come back and cut this. And so um, then this part, we are going to go ahead and we're going to, let's see, what are our sizes? Okay, so regular size, pretty much regular size. We don't have any like tiny pieces in here, I don't think. So that's what I'm doing is I'm going through and checking so I think we can do two holes, okay? Um, now I know I need to take apart this little guy, okay? Remember this, um, the way this was folded, okay? It had a spe special fold so that it would tuck. I'm gonna just go ahead and put the sides around, okay? So. That will tuck. Okay, I'm gonna put it like that. And I am going to need some of these. I think I'm gonna use my my hole punch because I need bigger holes because we're gonna use like a ribbon. Okay. So we're doing the ribbon and lace um, binding.
Okay. And come over here. Sorry, I have some, I have this. I have some things over here that I saved. Ooh, we have this. Now that could get attached to something. We have this. I think this would be cool. Now, if I can uh, thread that. Okay, there we go. So I have that. Oh, we moved. I want to stay straight, straight, stay straight. Okay, I think we can move. I did, I did fussy cut those out while I was waiting for something to upload. We'll go ahead and cut this. So I can get this off the table. <laughs> okay, here's this. So I'm thinking, I think I can try the small. Okay, so I have this all lined up. And that's the large. This is the small. If I go in, okay, to as far as it'll let me go in, okay, on the small. And it will go through all of those pages. The Cropodile is an amazing tool. I use it in crafting. I use it in house management, taking, fixing things, taking care of things. Um, yeah, all the things. Okay, so that is ready. So we're still waiting for this to dry. And so um, we can go ahead and start it. So I want it to start on the outside though, because I like the ones where I made the outside where the bow was. Um, and I made it have a little dangle. So that's what we're... That's what we're going to do. Okay. So say it's going to be right about there. I might need to, to cut into that. Okay. So, um, anyway, so I have that much ready and we're going to let that dry and we'll be back. So, okay. They're a little bit tacky on the inside here. But let's go ahead and where's our, okay, so we're going to line this up and we have this little hole right here. Oh, it's a little, it's a little hole. Is it going to let me through? It is. It is. It is. Okay. So there's that one. Okay, then we'll take this off. And of course, this would be easier if you just, you know, had it and you were able to just go through one side. And then, you know, come from the outside in, around, and out. But because I'm trying to do things <laughs> and get it done... <laughs> But look at here, we will have finished our adorable little lace journal. I love it. And you know, look at this. It's going to go through the same type of hole right here. That wasn't even planned. I just laid that lace, lace down. Just like that. Okay, so that gets pulled in. 
Okay, I want... Okay, there's some plastic to put for there. And a piece of plastic for the back. Okay. And then pull it all the way to the edge. Pull this one all the way to the edge. And then coming up, tying it up high and tight. Okay, and then double knotting it. Okay, and then we can take the needle off. Just like that. Okay. So that's what our what our outside is gonna look like. Pull this so it comes down below. It's got some bow wings. Okay. Bow wings. We can Stretch those so they look nice. Flatten them out. Stretch. Pull. Cut. Cut. Seahorses in here. I think I have, I think she likes dolphins. I wonder if I can put that on a jump ring. Something makes me think she likes dolphins. So I have, I have a dolphin. either do this or I could put well could do okay, put it put it on there ooh I like that do I have a yellow I have a wildflower. Ooh, I have a I have a yellow bead. It's big. Big yellow bead. Okay, I like that. Okay, we have we have really bright. Which is kind of cool because, you know, we don't always have the really bright. Um, what if, what, do we have a yellow? Yeah. Yellow. Yellow little. Really bright. Oh, that's not yellow. How did I end up with pink two times? Trying for yellow, got pink two times. So there's a yellow and where, oh where, oh where could that, the happy face. Aha, here we go. Look at you guys. 
a happy face flower with the orange. Is that gonna be too big? That's too big. But we can put it on top of a, a dolphin. So you can um, find these like at Party City. Um, the erasers start watching. I got many, a lot of mine at Target during holidays. Um, you know how they change their their mini dollar spot. <laughs> uh, used to be the Target dollar spot. Now it's the mini dollars <laughs> okay so I'm gonna go ahead and attach these charms to the lace piece here okay so just like that that'll hang off there and then this one We'll just give it those. I usually cut that off. Uh-oh. Haven't done that in a long time. <laughs> it's real life. <laughs> This is how things really happen. I do have another one of these bright beads that I'll be able to put on the other one. So just don't pull. Okay, I think we lost some. So here are my little dangles added with the dolphin and the bead dangle and our beautiful um, lace. I am going to be adding some ribbon here because this ended up kind of tacky. So let's go ahead and take a look. And so I do still want to do something there. Maybe, you know what? Maybe we'll just go ahead and add, add this. Okay, so I'm just going to put this in and I'm going to put it at an angle. So it covers the words. Okay. And I think that's kind of, I think that's cute. This was actually going to go in the other one of these journals, but that's okay. Um, so here's my stack of note. It is the, the calendar. We did our stenciling here. We have this little goodie here. And so something can go in there. And we've got our two tickets and we've got a space for something to go in there. Our magnet from the, our magnet closure. That was from our mini challenge in the challenge. Added the napkin and this is our California dreaming. I made that out of a tag from a beach towel. We have our index card that also is from the mini challenge in the challenge. Here's the other magnet from the other mini challenge in the challenge. We have our tag with our t insert there and some note paper and a daisy tag there. Just a couple fun things. This is a note paper that opens up and opens all the way out and added a little heart here under our paper clip. There's our other magnet, the large tag. That was G day. There's um, index card and C was um, corner tech. Another um, tag made out of a beach towel tag 
our double tuck. And turn that over and see that that has that and then has a little note paper inside. We did a little collage here and added a little tag and that has a fun little envelope. This is a fabric flip and underneath we have a little stack of note. Our flip flop and it has a heart in the pocket there. We had this and we added paper to the back of that. More stenciling. I love the girls all through this. I love the old books. This was our um, lace pocket, double pocket. So there's a pocket here and a pocket here. And then you can fold it up. And so that is my little journal for my friend Nora. And I chose to do the lace spine on it and I love it. Um, my glue ended up, it was still tacky. So, um, so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to add this um, ribbon that says friends and that will just cover up where the tacky is and it will be ready for me to give to her. So, yeah, so I'm just going to go ahead and put that down. I'll hang it down here. And I love this. What do you think? What do you think of my little, my little, little journal? Do you have any of these books? They sure, I mean, they were everywhere when I was a kid. I remember we, um, we got them for birthdays and stuff. Along with that, um, we would get the dolls. The they were ceramic, and they had some of. Sometimes they had like the number of our year. Sometimes they would have our birthstone. Um, they might be on our cake. This is my sister and I when we were little and growing up. And my mom got them at the Rexall Pharmacy. <laughs> okay. So there you go. It's ready. And I think it is going to be a great little gift. So I do have another one that I'm going to be finishing up. And then this one will be in the shop. I'll put it in the shop for pre-order. I'll put it in there today. So the first one that purchases it, um, I'll send it out as soon as it's finished. So there you go. I hope you enjoyed. And um, let me show you. I'll go pick out a cover for it. So I've chosen that cover. So that will be the cover for this one. And so, yeah, it'll be in there pre-order. And so I hope you check that out. Find something to celebrate every day. Have an amazing day. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye-bye.